Hi guys, welcome back to Bill Gates Technical Tinkering. Today we're going to install Linux on an ASUS laptop. Uh, in my last video, I installed a Linux Mint on a Windows 10. So there's the Mint. We're going to install a different Linux. So click on whatever Linux you want. We're going to click on this one here. So scroll down. We're going to go to uh, the desktop version. And then click on download. And we're going to go to save as desktop and save. Click OK. And wait for it to download. While we're getting that downloaded, we'll head over to Rufus here and download the latest version. I'll leave the links at the bottom. I have it installed, so I will just run it. And it needs a device, so grab a USB and plug it in. And then we're going to select the image file. Just click on that. And we're going to leave it on MBR bias. And leave it on default. We're going to hit start. And right in ISO image mode. Just click OK. Accept the warning for all data to be de destroyed and wait for it to be complete okay so when it's done downloading we're going to close this and eject the usb pull it out plug it into the laptop that we want it to be installed and you can see it there pop up now this way works on Linux and Windows as well so we're gonna power off shut down and we're gonna start it up and hit F2 a bunch of times and and get into BIOS here. We're going to go to boot. We're going to find our uh, our disk and move it up. And then we're going to go to save and exit. Hit enter. Hit enter again. Okay, so oh, didn't let me choose anything. It should load up automatically. There we go. And just let it load. Alright, so no errors found. Let it load. Okay. So I'll click install. Pick your language. Over on the left. And then click install.
keyboard I want is US. And continue. And then we are going to connect to a wireless network here. Find your network, put in the password, um, and then connect. And continue. And then we're going to, well, you don't have to, I'm going to click on install third party software and continue. Now it gives you the option if you just want the basic utilities and web browser. If you don't really play games or music and stuff like that, then go for the minimal. So I'll click continue. Let it load. I'm going to erase disk. And yeah, I'm not going to encrypt the drive. Erase this, that's a clean install. So click install now. And we are going to continue. And let it load. And then we are going to choose our location and just start typing the city you're in. It should pop up. So I got my city there. Click on that. And then continue. And then put your name there or your alias or whatever you want. Pick a computer name, pick a username, and put in uh, a password you want. And then uh, we'll go and log in automatically. And once you get all that completed, just click continue. And let it load. Okay, so installation is complete. We'll just restart now. And wait for it to restart. All right, so remove the USB. Hit enter. Just let it load. And there we go. So I'll just skip the setups. service off and done there you have it we installed a Linux don't forget to subscribe down below